Hi everyone, this is Holly again here doing a review this time on crochet hooks. Um, I've been crocheting since I was five years old. My mom taught me how to crochet. Um, I actually crocheted this panel as part of a blanket. Um, I bought the Pioneer Woman crochet hook. This came with one set, and this came with one set at Walmart. Now, I was really excited because I really wanted this color because I really like the color blue. Um, my sister Willie loves Pioneer Woman. I also got the scissors of Pioneer Woman. Um, I like the blue version of her stuff. My sister loves everything Pioneer Woman. Now, I have a problem with this. These were kind of expensive for me. I don't make much money. So these are kind of expensive for me. Um, these ones are fine. Um, not too bad. Uh, I don't know if you can see that. If it's going to focus. But the, you get the name, the letter up here. And it's put out by boy. I mean, they're, they're pretty and everything. The problem I have with these. There is a problem. Now, this one, I don't use much, okay? I don't use, I use mostly a 5 millimeter crochet hook majority of the time. The problem I had is this is the hook that I use majority of the time, okay? Look at what happens. You cannot even see the number on here anymore from the yarn. And this is just from me using it after a month. And then I had stopped using it. Because all the pretty designs started coming off. Now, I don't know if they can fix this or if they need to, you know, figure it out or something, but... I would not buy these if I would have known this was happening. This would happen. I would not waste my money on it. Speaking that these are kind of expensive for me. Um, you can't even tell what size this hook is anymore. Because it used to have the same thing that this has. So I'm assuming probably all these will have that happen if you use them a lot. Like this is the 5mm. Um... I think this is the six, I think. And then this is the little one below that one, I think. I'm not 100% positive. <laughs> but, um, like I said, I used this one the most. And in a month, that's what happened. But I want everybody to know if this could happen if you buy these crochet hooks. And most likely, it probably will. And this happened, the lettering happened because the yarn kept rubbing here. And so it rubbed the number off. So that's why the number got rubbed off. Now, I'm not saying I don't like boy hooks. Because I do. I have these ones that I use all the time. I use these ones all, like literally all the time. Like, all the time. These are my favorite hooks. I use those ones. Um, I have one like this that I use. Um, I've only used once. Uh, I have, like, these ones. I don't really like these ones. I think this is a Susan Bates. Um... Yeah, this is a Susan Bates one. I don't really like the metal ones. I learned on those ones, but I don't really care for them. Um, I like the ergonomical hooks. Um, I have this one. That I like to use when I'm doing my amigurumis. So, I like that one. Um, but yeah, I have, like, this is just a small amount that I have. That I keep out, you know, just for grabbing purposes. Um, but 
I just wanted to come on here and do this short, short video just to let you guys know. I've never done her yarn. I'm actually afraid to spend the money on her yarn after the hook incident. Like, is it going to, if I get the yarn and make a toy or a blanket out of it, is it going to bleed in the wash? Is it going to fall apart on a child? Because I sell my toys. Is it going to fall apart on the child? Is it going to unravel when somebody buys my toys or buys my blankets? Because I make personalized baby blankets or personalized blankets for anybody. Is it going to unravel? Because, I mean, her yarn is expensive. So people are going to have to pay more for that blanket. So, I mean, is it going to unravel? And then that takes a hit at my small business. So, I'm afraid to buy her yarn to do any of my crocheting projects with. Because I just don't know if it's going to bleed, if it's going to unravel, if it going to fray if it's going to be hard to actually crochet with so it's just it's not feasible for me to try out the yarn um but at least not for right now um but I just wanted to let you guys know that this probably will happen if you buy these hooks just to be mindful that this probably could happen and probably will happen and the lettering probably will wear off. So you might want to write down like either write down what type of hook this is or get one of those um, things that tell you what type of hook you have or you know if you can remember what type of hook this is. Or something like that. I don't know. But for me. I won't be replacing these. When these are done. They're done. I won't be replacing these. I'll probably just stick with these ones for now. Like I said. I like these ones. I've never had a problem with them. The, the numbers never. Um, it's not focusing. <laughs> the numbers have never. Come on. Focus camera. I'm trying to get it to focus. There goes a little bit. There we go. The number has never worn off. And I've had this for over a year. And it still looks basically brand new. Um, I don't even know if I've ever used this size. <laughs> like I said, I usually crochet smaller projects. So I don't even know if I've ever used like these big, huge ones. So, um... There's that, and I just wanted everybody to know, you know, be mindful of this could happen. So just be careful about buying it, you know, just, I just can't stress that enough. Just, I don't want someone else who is, you know, strapped for cash in these times, because I know... Cost of living's gone up, rent's gone up, food's gone up, um, all, everything has gone up, um, electricity, all that has gone up, and people are having more difficult time paying, you know, their bills and whatnot, and small little luxuries that we can afford, and then, you know, you want to splurge on a little something for yourself, and then something like this happens. So, I just want you guys to be mindful of that. Alright, I hope you guys liked this video. Give me a thumbs up if you did. And if you want to see more reviews like this, let me know. If you want to see more crochet videos, let me know. I have tons of, um, I could do crochet tutorials if you like. Um, just let me know what you would like. Alright, thanks. Bye.